uh, focus on one of two grips, okay? Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to sit through, come back over on top, all right? I usually start with the seat belt, okay? Or sorry, the uh, tight waist, double unders, whatever the hell you want to call it. Both hands around his belt line, okay? Mostly because I'm right there and that's the closest thing to grab. You can also do the, uh, the hook and the spiral. That works too. Whatever you're comfortable with, okay? From here, I almost always switch through to a seat belt. And that's one over, one under, okay? This one's really good for scrambles. If I hug him tight enough and I keep my head there, it doesn't matter if he rolls around on me. I've still got this and I can put my hooks in and put it back where I want, okay? I can also transition from here to a choke, okay? Or here to an arm lock if I really needed to, okay? So it's a pretty, pretty well-rounded grip to use. You can do the same thing with this one too, but you have to work a little bit at it, okay? So one of those two around the waistline, okay, or the seat belt. Okay, I want everybody to get used to doing that, and then we'll add the hooks to it, okay? Do you want to do it from a, a, a go behind, like yeah. at the bottom, okay, go behind, escape? And you can either do it where he's already got the ride, and the way to do that is if he's already riding me, okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kick out, sit through, okay, catch, and come around. We'll go around in a little circle until I catch that inner, that switch, and then sit through, okay? We can also, if you're not ready for that one yet, just do the standard, he's over like this that we always do, the judo switch, go ahead and sit through. There you go. So he comes up and around, okay? We've done that a million times. If you're more comfortable with that one, do that one, okay? All right.